When residents from Sharon, Tunbridge, Stratford, and Royalton headed to their town meetings, they knew that one article they'd be voting on has stirred up controversy. A whole lot in all four, all four towns that it's affecting. It centers around the building of a multi-billion dollar experimental community called New Vistas. It would be home to 20,000 new residents. It's the brainchild of Utah developer David Hall, and many voters don't like the idea. It's too big of a project for our rural area. There is going to be more people in that project than the four surrounding towns that it wants to occupy. According to its website, the New Vistas Foundation is committed to making it a sustainable community, a concept that Tunbridge resident Henry Swayze likes. It's really interesting and he may be on to some good things. But it wasn't enough to win him over. The scale of the project and the fact that it's so top down is just not at all what what any rural community in Vermont uh, needs. That's a big reason why all four towns overwhelmingly voted to oppose the project. The vote isn't binding, but one that residents hope sends a message. The supporters of this uh, article thought it was important that the voters express themselves uh, and that the public uh, gets on record uh, opposing this development. Royalton resident Jeff Barcello voted in support of the project. He says since his town doesn't have zoning, Hall can purchase land there just like anyone else. If the town of Royalton chooses not to have zoning, then that's their choice to let other individuals do what they want with their land for their choice. But even so, many want to maintain the existing character of the towns for years to come. In Royalton, Helena Batapaglia, NBC 5 News.